friends Cheeks here. <laughs> right, do it again. I missed it. Oh, hello, my friends Cheeks here. Anthony here. <laughs> I'm Daniel. And it's Friday Night Live, and we are. I was just sending a text here, so some links. It's a special night tonight. Yeah. yeah. I'm just sending uh, links. So, uh, anyways, busy day. And look, I'm, I've been rushed tonight to get to the live tonight. I don't even have my chain. Oh no! It's not official until I get the chain. Anthony. Where's the chain? Okay, hold on. Let me get the chain, Daniel. Oh, I can get it. Okay, yeah, you go you get it. You go get it. And I uh, get my uh, power power uh, wristbands too. <laughs> get the wristband. Get out there. Yeah, get those. I can get the yellow. Get uh, having yellow tonight. Okay. All right. So there it is. Let me just put it on officially. I think last week I wasn't here. Anthony and Daniel man the show here. It was so awkward. And what? It was, it was awkward. It was was awkward they said, but they did the live so great. And we, me and uh, Camera Lady went to a concert. We went to see Honeymoon Suite, which was great in Oshawa. You guys did a great job. Anyways, uh, anyways, we want to say happy birthday to my niece Angelica. Uh, she yeah, turns she 19 tonight. Today. Oh my God, 19. And she said she had a cannoli birthday cake. Cannoli themed birthday cake, or it's like a cannoli cake. Well, at least someone enjoys it out there. So, anyways, <laughs> happy birthday. Uh, she's on the live here. Happy birthday. Yeah. And we got a whole bunch of sweets tonight to show. And since it's uh, birthday time, we have chocolate tonight. There's Tony's Chocoloni. This is Ben and Jerry's. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. And this one is uh, white chocolate strawberry cheesecake. Okay. And then we also got a Ben and Jerry's chocolate love affair and this one's milk chocolate with brownie dark right there wait does that say choco lonely yeah choco lonely and no lonely like choco lonely 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 choco lonely lonely there's like, and they got another lonely. flavor here which is crazy now these are special chocolates we got them in chicago at the sweets and snacks show in may this one is everything bar and it's uh Milk chocolate with caramel, pretzel, almond, nougat, and sea salt. Now, what's so special about it? It's a crazy. They had a big booth there, and they're uh, basically, uh, Anthony, you can go to the website okay. and just ex quickly oh. talk about their, their story. There's a story with this, and basically their mission is to eliminate uh, child slave labor uh, around the world, mostly in Africa, That's because nice. of uh, cocoa farming, and the big conglomerates have uh, really lowered the price for uh, labor so much for the price that they happen to have a climate for child slave labor in Africa and some other countries as well. So they're doing like slave free trade. Uh, they're paying the price, and all their chocolate goes for labor that is paid fairly. And so if you buy that, you're supporting eliminating slave, slave free, slave child labor around the world. So that is their goal, Tony's. Great story. <laughs> slave free cocoa, right? Did you guys remember the booth at all? They had, they had all these oh, man, chocolates. They had a whole wall like this of just chocolates. I remember, I remember seeing this like- Well, the Ben and Jerry's thing. is basically uh, one of their special theme chocolates, but it's basically Tony's. So very cool. Look at the size of these bars. These are huge bars. Huge. Huge. Look at them. They're huge. I'm just saying, what size is these bars? But they're these are made in Belgium. And I want to thank Tony's at the booth. There was uh, the rep there. She uh, gave me a whole bunch of chocolates and. I said, "Yeah, we're gonna do a video." So here we go. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to figure out what this means. Choco what? lonely, choco lonely, and then it has a chocolate love affair thing underneath it. What's this? Now, I'm guessing this is supposed to be a Valentine's thing, but shouldn't Valentine's uh, that that I just showed that? Oh, okay. Shouldn't the Valentine snacks be like choco not lonely? They're not Valentine snacks. Well, yeah, but it says chocolate love affair because it's it's. Chocolate love affair, like fair love, fair trade chocolate. That is what they're saying. <laughs> okay. You're always seeing some cool stuff at Product Patrol. So this is cool chocolates. They are on Amazon. These flavors, I couldn't really find them, but they have some other flavors. You want to check the board quickly? Oh, yeah, that's before a good I open idea. this up. 
Good job. All right. Have a happy birthday, Angelica. Uh, good evening, Chiefs, Anthony, and Daniel. I'm glad you had a great time at the concert. Thank you. Honeymoon Suite, Edward. They are amazing. One of Canada's crazy, awesome 80s rock bands like pop rock. And check them out. You've probably heard of them. I'm not sure, but they're, they're amazing. you probably heard of the song Wave Babies. And anyways, that's a good song. You probably shouldn't say pop rocks to a food audience. They might think something different. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I guess basically, then, uh, uh, yeah. yeah, we will bring some of these chocolates. You can have a taste. So don't worry. We're going to save you some, especially the strawberry cheesecake, Tony's. All right. Have you seen the movie Sound of Freedom? Yes. Oh, that was a good movie. We saw that like, I don't know. In July, I don't know why I was really enjoying in it. In July, like, maybe I know. June? I know that the movie is supposed to be showing really bad, dark stuff, but I was sitting there enjoying it the whole way through. Yeah, it was, it was a great. Like, oh, look at this mission! Look at this raid! They're going in. They're getting everything. Yeah, it was uh, pretty was tense. Fun. Some parts of the movie, but you know, we enjoyed it. We sat. We went to the movie theater, and we loved it. Yeah. Had a great time. Anyways, let's crack this open because everyone's waiting. We're also going to do these. We got these at the snack show as well. They're very popular. Cages. They're plant-based gummies. Is it catches? Catches? I don't know. Catches? Like catches? Plant I can Google Translate. <laughs> plant-based gummies. <laughs> what nationality is this? Uh, gummy. This is gummy candy. It says Sharos. Uh, Sharos? No animal gelatin. And this is made in the USA. It says it's USA, but I don't think that name is USA. So we're going to do that. We also got something from Australia. Did I get that right? Australia. Okay. <laughs> These are down unders. They had a booth there. They were a new product. I met the guys Here there. The and the founders are Adam, Jonathan, and Sarah. I want to say hi, guys. We did it. We got here on the show at Product Patrol. These are chocolate-covered licorice, Australian black, dipped in milk chocolate. And go to licorice.com. Licorice and we're going to do those as well. Now, also, I want to, we have the crazy nuts. Now, yes. uh, these are We Are Nuts. And I want to say hi, Michael. Michael's crazy. He was at the booth. I, I, we met him at his booth, sorry. And uh, I said, why you're not so great and he let it rip for like almost a minute of why his nuts are so great so it's very funny clip and we're going to post it it's actually on TikTok. we did we put it on TikTok, but we finally made it here to do your nuts michael <laughs> now when they see sweets and snacks expo yeah the entire snacks part is nuts there's nothing else but nuts in that expo well, the entire thing just Nuts. Oh, my, is my as well have what called it about? sweet and nuts. There was, um, Anthony, this there is was, a chocolate bar. It was yeah, not nuts. There was lots yeah, but of they said It says sweet and snacks, but they should have said sweet and nuts because the nuts was the only snacks there. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but the nuts are <laughs> I've, got, I've got all the other beef jerky and chocolate and candy and oh, all yeah, that whatever. stuff. Uh, <laughs> whatever. Sweets <laughs> and protein. You must have not seen the bin we came in with. Anthony. Okay, oh, I'm what? opening this up, guys. Okay, you want to hold that first? Yeah, sure. And what's this here? Declaration. Guys, look, it's an iron ingot. You want to turn that into it into a says figure? better together. <laughs> That's what it says on here. I guess is this is their seal. United by a shared passion for social justice. Okay. Right now there are 30,000 cases of modern slavery and 1.56 million cases of child labor in the chocolate industry in Ghana and Cote d'Ivoire. The root cause, poverty. Okay, well, let's open it up. Spreading the word, spreading the awareness. So if you see chocolate, and so if you if you see these chocolate, buy them because you're supporting a good cause in the world. Oh, yeah. Apparently, speaking of child slavery, there was a pretty big uh, thing in Ohio a couple yeah. weeks ago. They apparently people saved putting. like 100 <laughs> children and arrested 100 <laughs> people. Just rip it. Rip it, rip it, good rip stuff. it, rip, 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 rip or go, rip it. What's that one? That's like white. Wow, that's weird. Look at that. What the heck is that cookie? Wow, look at the size of this bar. It looks like cookie dough. Wow, it's like a smash through the wall. Wow, Tony's. 
It's white chocolate, strawberry cheesecake. You should be their spokesperson. Oh man, smart, smart. What is it? White chocolate, strawberry, cheesecake. chocolate, strawberry cheesecake. Strawberry. You just like announced what white. it was. Like where's three the strawberry? Ago. Look at the nice. I see print. brown. It looks almost like a tire track, but eh? no strawberry. It's like a tire track. Yeah, it kind of does. It's like like you, you like, see, it looks like something you tear off. You can Jeep. see the bits on the other side. <laughs> All right. Oh, there's the strawberry. I don't want to eat too much. Oh, we got lots of chocolate. Oh, there's the, the strawberries on the inside. Yeah, it's like little strawberry bits. It. Yeah, see, the little strawberry bit in there. Mm -hmm. This is actually really good. It's very like creamy, and they're uh, just eating strawberry bits. I'm trying to remember like where strawberry it, jam bits. It, yeah, it tastes like it has the it has the texture of that you know at the bottom of the strawberry cheesecake where it's like the sort of like yeah, the gram hardened the yeah gram. the gram yeah and then wow. the aftertaste is the strawberry cheesecake itself. Yeah, it's this creamy. is really good. It's like buttery, like uh, like an almond buttery or like butter, like um, no, I'm not saying like buttery. Yeah, it's great, creamy. Yeah, very. It's like a total dessert. What do you think, Daniel? I broke a back. <laughs> you broke more. <laughs> good. And cheeks approved. Great. Daniel, what do you think? You approve? Great. Daniel says approve. That's Triple right. We're all in unison tonight. Good stuff. Okay, next up, this one is the everything bar. Uh -oh, this is no. a regular Tony's. Does it have does it have pickle juice? No, Daniel's <laughs> eating pickle juice, drinking pickle juice there and reeking the place. Crazy said crazy about chocolate, serious oh, about people. It's it's okay. You're the only one that doesn't enjoy it. <laughs> Chaj and I live on that stuff. Okay, 14 grams of sugar per serving. It's not too bad. If you want to see some pure pickle juice enjoyment, Whoa. go look at our previous stream. <laughs> okay, there's that one. Oh, what the heck? Oh wow. Okay, this one is another big bar. They're it's all, the, they're look, all the same. Okay, th there's one complaint I have about Tony's. I don't like their website. It's bright red and then Tony's. bright white. Get it? And then bright blue. There's like so much contrast that it's actually hard. To this read looks like the uh, you, you know how they put concrete and they make a pattern. This is way nicer. It's just <laughs> white on red. He's going. <laughs> Anyways, like Anthony, you know the pattern of the concrete. Yeah. But but so you can make. <laughs> You can have a pattern. Tonys! You mean like a brick, <laughs> make a brick house out of Tonys? It's like crispy. Look, look at the crispy texture over here. You see that? Yeah. Oh, look at that, people. Oh, look at that. <laughs> okay, people. I Looks like somebody piece. just went out of a mud pit from like a monster truck. Everything bar. Wow, big crispies in there and nuts. Oh, yeah. Now, that's a big, it almost tastes like a Nestle Crunch, but with, with nuts and thick. Mm. It does the ingredients. Rich milk chocolate, pretzel. No, that's it. Pretzel. Oh, pretzel. There's pretzel that's in why here. it tastes weird. Almond, nougat, and sea salt. I can taste mm. the sea salt as well in there. And uh, that's the almond, the nougat. I don't know about the nougat. Maybe. There's a bit of nougat. It's like a bit sticky in some places. And there's caramel in here too, but uh, it must be like I have no mixed in or something. But it's very cool bar. <laughs> Definitely an everything bar. Cheeks approved. Do people actually like sea salt? Eh. This one's not that great compared to the strawberry. You salt. like the strawberry? I so feel like sea salt yeah. just makes everything worse. Okay. No, it's the nougat that makes everything worse. Okay. Step next up, we what have chocolate with brownie. Oh, Dark insects milk. trying to climb up my milk. Anthony, it's milk chocolate with brownie and dark milk chocolate. Oh, dark milk chocolate. Oh, yeah. What the heck is Ooh. dark milk chocolate? Tony's. Yeah, well, like 50 percent. <laughs> you can like throw it's like a big brick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very curious to see what this dark milk chocolate looks like. Oh, wow, that is dark. What the heck? Tony's. No, chocolate's usually like. <laughs> right brown. This is like wow. That's milk chocolate. Tony's. <laughs> Break it. Why are you taking the hat? Oh. <laughs> I know. Why are you taking? I'm getting too excited chunk? here. 
Okay, there you go. Okay, well, how are we going to put that all back now? Oh, it's, 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 it's huge. Look at it. That is nice. That's a dark chocolate. What a small piece. Milk and dark, and it's brownie. Ready? This is really weird. Tastes like a thick brownie. It's both heart. milk and dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. And the dark chocolate's really strong in the aftertaste. Yeah, it's like like really thick, fudgy. Yeah, and yeah, it's like but yeah, melt it's in your like mouth. Brownie. There's a bit of like that crunchiness with, with too. brownie. But you're almost thinking if you can taste the brownie, like cake in there, like but it's like dusty in a way and, and mixed with the chocolate and and there's all just melted. enough to feel it. Unbelievable. That's really good. Too um, much rich for me, but. That's a lot of chocolate. Yeah, dark honestly, chocolate. So I'll fun. just go with this again. Mm. I'm not really the biggest fan of it. That's, I still that's prefer the strawberry so and cheese. It's not good. So you don't like dark chocolate? Doesn't mean it's not good. I like it. Cheeks are free. Oh, what was what that? What did you just do? I don't know. What was that? Something no, just no, jumped no. off the uh, the table. I think you, no, you punched it off. <laughs> Weird. That? Oh, that was my water. How did that happen? Okay. It was all the way over there. Because he punched it. How? He went that like this. stuff would have fallen off the table too. Probably because he hit this and it bounced into the water bottle that was behind it. <laughs> what? what? You're saying it pinballed okay. off this stuff that's lighter. We're going to Australia right How now. How does that work? These are down unders, another new okay. product. Yeah, yes, but off. that would have fallen too. No. Have you ever played like any game? Yes, tiny tanks. I know how this stuff works. Bro. That's not how it works. Okay, I can already smell licorice. Smell that. Oh, you it's like licorice from there. the all sorts. No, I'm not really sure about that with chocolate. They're a very unique product, but here you are, people. We have a chocolate. They're like a big chunk of black licorice, covered in milk chocolate. Look at that. Okay. Now look, I'm you can just... see it. You see it? You see Anthony in there? Yeah. Okay, you see that? Yeah. That's it. I don't really like it when licorice is that thick, though. I know. This is major thick stuff. Thick. It's like a... That's a really a soft licorice. That's really soft. If you really love licorice, premium licorice. Yeah, well, I don't. We also had the cherry, or the strawberry one, the strawberry licorice, but I gave it away. Enjoy, Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> and then I check, and we only we have two two black packages. We don't have the cherry, the strawberry. Mm. So, anyways, enjoy, Wayne. <laughs> we only have black left. <laughs> oh, good. I would, <clears throat> if I had the cherry one, that would be an instant thumb down. I, oh, I love strawberry red licorice. licorice. Red licorice is the worst, unless it's a regular Twizzler. There's definitely a different take on if you're enjoying licorice. So. You know what? It just tastes like somebody dipped a Twizzler in chocolate. Mm. Mm. The thick. It doesn't taste like black licorice at all. It's it's uh it's good quality <laughs> licorice and it's nice treat with the chocolate. You know what? Uh, it anyways, it tastes fruit. like a licorice all sorts. Mm -hmm. It actually does. Okay, there you go. Because like, it's, it's black licorice. Yes, but it has the sweetness <laughs> of the licorice all sorts. Anyways, check them yes, out because they have licorice.com. Moving on, chocolate this candy. They're still Daniel, doing... why are you still sitting here, bro? Okay, it was a on. part of a live. What do you mean? <laughs> You're not welcome anymore. Animal, no animal gelatin, plant based gummies. All right, like plant based marshmallows. I have their thing here. I am going to see. What nationality this is from, so I can get the actual pronunciation for it. It must be just a name of the founder. Probably. Or it says that KG. Germany! Germany! It is Katja! Okay. It is Katja. Okay, Katches. Katches? Katja. Katja. Okay. Katja. So Anthony uh, really wanted these vegan marshmallows, and we uh, we went and bought them dandies. If uh, you see them, they're on Amazon. They're really good. They're Vegan marshmallows, so uh, we don't have any more because we ate them all. <laughs> but, <laughs> oh, it is Katya. Okay, so Katya. Here, here, look, it's a little picture for somebody. Look, it's an Instagram girl, Katya. Katya, yeah. Okay. Hello. <laughs> huh? 
You see her? Give me the gummy worm. Look. So we're eating someone? Right. Oh, this is a worm. Oh, no. Okay. What does it say? It's a name? Oh. What does it say on there? Uh, you rock. And this is a... Is a this says, you can't read it, but this says you rock. It's like... Oh yeah, this is a this is a girl. That must be her, and she's going like this. Catch us! She's like she's going like this with her fingers. Well, she looks like she's living her best life over there. She, what is she an astronaut? Yes. She's exploring all the different galaxies of candy. And now I have wiped out one galaxy. <laughs> It's very uh, vibrant. It's, oh, it was gummy. at the park bench. It's just, like a bit tangy, but it's like it's got like some like kind of kind of like a herb aroma to it. Taste. Well, like, it's made out of plants. This, this kind of looks like candy. Yeah, plant-based gummies, but it's very uh, fruity but flowery. Well, how else will they make? Yeah, it taste like it's that? like it combines <laughs> two things together. You have wow. the actual gummy on top, and then you have like this sort of really of soft it. candy corn on the everybody. bottom. It's very cool. It's got some the white part. I think this is like yogurt or no, something. No, not like is candy this corn, yogurt. Like, you, you, know, have, you know those you know, you know those gummy gummy right? sharks? <laughs> they have the blue gummy on top and the white like condensed gummy on the bottom. That's what it's. That's what it's. Yeah, but like. I think it's. Is this like what type of yogurt type of candy? Because they have yogurt gummies that they also sell. That's what they're famous for. But no, oh, hey, hey give me give me one of those uh, yellow ones again. Well, they're very tasty. They're very good. I'm very pleasantly surprised. Because it's like very <laughs> fruity. I can receive our fun song. You don't know what he's going to do. Anyways, check him out. Very cool. Cheeks approved. It's Squidward. Very good. Oh, better than all the other plant gummies I've had, but like, no. All right, Daniel's being positive. I still like, <laughs> I still like normal gummies. No, they're pretty good. They're pretty good. Good job, Katya. They're just not as rubbery. Did as you get they're... that right, Katya's? Yeah, Katya. Woohoo! So I guess I was wrong. It wasn't Katya. So you're it was Katya. approved and you're approved. We're all in unison again. No, okay. it's okay. Yeah, it's that, okay. oh, only Daniel just goes okay now. How did you just drop down? No, I said it's better than all the other vegan gummies I've had, but it's like not better than normal ones anyway. <laughs> so what does that mean? That it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> we don't. <laughs> Our okay is like this. Yeah, not, it's not up. It's not down. It's in the middle. Daniel's okay. Daniel's like, like, like this. Daniel's like <laughs> mystery unknown. <laughs> Do you like it? Well, it's okay. Yeah, Daniel. Daniel's okay. Like it's, it's like this. It's better Daniel's than other ones. Daniel's disapproval better. is like this. No, no, that's bad. Daniel just says it sucks. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> okay, we're going to. We are nuts, and they have a lot of. We are nuts. We oh are my nuts. god. We are nuts. No, we are nuts. We're, we're crazy. We are nuts. <laughs> what do we do here? We're nuts. I don't know. And this, what we got today? These are from Minnesota, Minneapolis. Did I get that right? Minneapolis, Minnesota. <laughs> I'm going crazy. Minneapolis, <laughs> Minnesota. That's where they are. And uh, anyways, Michael, here we go. For you, we're opening and trying here. Look, look how happy that guy is. Look. You see that, Anthony? Look how happy he is. He's going nuts. He is nuts. <laughs> He's going nuts. He's going nuts. This is maple bourbon almonds, and they're going, called. Hey! It says upcycled, <laughs> made with Twin Cities breweries spent grain, so it's net zero. Okay, that's different. Everything is green nowadays. Okay, it says made with Minnesota's. It's black. Made with Minnesota's very own Tattersall. Tattersall. Okay. No, you know what I meant by green, bro. Yeah, but. You're not referring to this. No, I'm not referring Whoa. to the color. Wow. Wow. That, that smells is, like oatmeal. That's like. That's like. That's maple and brown sugar oatmeal. Or cinnamon oatmeal. Yeah, I don't know. Cinnamon, cinnamon something. This is maple bourbon. It's very. Uh, it's the cinnamon cr cr it's toast crunch oatmeal. It's I only crazy nuts. Look at these crazy that's nuts. That's what it is. It's huge. 
coated. Look at these big nuts. Hey, hand me one of those cheeks. Hand You're it crazy. Over. Look at the size yeah. of those. I'm going crazy. Do you like crazy nuts? <laughs> I'm crazy for nuts. <laughs> I'm crazy for nuts. <laughs> These are stale. Nice, sweet. No, it's like what sugary you coating. Saying everything is stale. <laughs> you know what it kind of tastes like? It's a like? roasted almond in the middle, and it's coated with like a thick coating, and it's dusty. So when you eat it's it, sort of, it kind of melts away in a powdery sweetness. It sort of tastes like there's like a bit of crunch, but yeah, no, like a kind of dusty crunch, like nougat. But it's just like, what is it called? Honey oat crisp, or oatmeal crisp, uh, honey. Flavor. Wow, oatmeal crisp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the little maple chunks almond. Again. Yeah, maple almond. Maple almond. Almond. Yeah. Like maple exactly. almond. Yeah, exactly. That's what it is. It's cereal. I'm going crazy for cereal. That was. Or I'm very, going nuts for cereal. Very interesting taste. Cheeks approved. I love them. I don't like it. <laughs> What? Don't like it. Daniel says no. What do you think, Anthony? More nuts, more nuts, more nuts. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we are nuts. Let's try this one. This one's our famous toffee peanuts, hot nuts. The nuts are hot. You got. Hot. We are hot. hot. We are hot nuts. Woo. Hot nuts. Michael, these nuts are hot. <laughs> <laughs> I Daniel, know nobody from school is yeah, watching. You like hot nuts? <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather freeze your pepper? Hot nuts or cold nuts? Hot nuts. Hot nuts. Daniel says hot nuts. We're getting close. Okay. Whoa! It smells like uh, it smells like we chicken. Had this before. It smells like no, we had a this fried exact chicken thing sandwich. Before. Tastes like Wendy's fried chicken sandwich. I know what this smells like. I don't remember the name though. Oh, they're it's, peanuts. It's, it's another oh. chicken. It's a, yeah, it's just a, a spicy it smells like peanut. chicken. Like a chicken. That's what it is. It's a spicy peanut. Thank you, Charlie. It's a hot nut. But it's exactly like, what it is. It almost smells like like fried chicken, like the sandwich. Look at it. There you go, people. Nice brown coating. I, I don't know why I was thinking of KFC. And then the theme song that came to my mind was selloffvacation.com. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, these ones are crunch. Oh, crunch. these are like total different. You know, it sucks. This would actually like be good. Hot barbecue. Peanuts. But it, it's sweet at the end, but it's hot. What a combination. Hot, yeah. peanut, and then sweet. It would be better as a toffee. And total crunchy. And a good sized peanut. Yeah. But it is hot. Oh, right? it's hot. Well, the other one was like stale. This is somehow crunchy. <laughs> what is this obsession with stale? You want to talk stale? That one's stale. That one's good. This one has a crunch. That one is just wet. Oh my god. Crunch. These are something you just sit down not everything and drink lots of beer with. It's stale. There's a beer nut right here. Totally. That's the yeah. spice. You just go to town. Fix a brew. Oh, That's really cool. I was just about to ask you for some pickle juice. Why don't you go get some? It's upstairs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Anyway, is that everything? That's everything for tonight. Oh, how exciting. Yeah, it's been a long day because uh, we've been working on our kitchen sink. Yeah. We had to replace it. It was a leak. And anyways, Luckily, we have a sink in the laundry room. Yeah, we're using the sink in the laundry room to do our dishes right it now. It sucks. But all day, we've been working that, and I painted a desk, and i got okay. camera lady outside with a campfire going right now. So it's been a crazy day. And anyway, we're going to Thanksgiving weekend in Canada here. So our Thanksgiving is before you guys, USA. It's the end of November. Ours is Sunday, October the 7th, 8th, 8th. Oh, I have so many things to be thankful of this year. Yeah. One of them is Ubisoft for coming out for the Crew Motor Fest, AKA the best racing game this decade. Anthony so far. Anthony's going about Motor Storm. Motor Fest. I Motor wish Fest. it was Motor Storm. Oh my god. I would kill to have another Codemasters game. You don't say that word, kill. Okay, whatever. But you're very excited. Yes. And what is Motor Fest? Motor Fest, okay. Think of Forza Horizon. <laughs> Nobody knows what this is <laughs> if you don't know about games, but basically you have this entire island of Hawaii 
and you get to drive monster trucks and cars and crap all over it and bikes. There's bikes in a racing motorfest. game. I know, right? Yeah. It's kind of when you're riding in the in the valley and people are riding all of a sudden they're trying to crash you and stuff. Yeah, because all the players suck. Is that motor? No, that's motor storm. But it, what's Motorfest? Motorfest. The biggest selling point of Motorfest, aside from the amazing developers who made the original the crew, 30 player races, eight minutes long. Nothing has ever been done like that before. <laughs> oh, you know what it's crazy. About? No. <laughs> what game are you gonna play after this live? Minecraft. Minecraft. Flash yes. With all of his friends. You want to say hi to any of your friends before you go back to the Live after the, I mean, go back to your game. Well, I don't know if they're here. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, you have no friends. Catch you guys next Friday. And, anyways, happy Thanksgiving to everyone in Canada. Happy Thanksgiving. And we're going to be eating lots of turkey and all the good stuff. I can't wait. I love Thanksgiving. And I love pumpkin pie. You like pumpkin pie now. Yep. You like pumpkin pie? We are crazy for pumpkin pie. Yeah. <laughs> and I bought one at a bakery, at Kawartha uh, Bakery. I'm making one, an E.D. Smith from the can, and I picked a lot of apples this year. So we've been making dried apples, but I will be making an apple pie as well. Woohoo! I have like 15 jars of dried apples. We yeah. have whipped cream, right? Uh, we will on Sunday. We have to. Yes. And then we have a bin Pumpkin full of apples. With whipped cream. We have a, what? We have a bin full of apples, then two baskets full of apples. We have lots of apples. I picked like and then yeah. a bucket. Oh, full of yeah. Apples. I picked like seven have... bushels of apples. Yes. Yeah. We have five different so types. many. Okay, guys, you, our kitchen counter is like as big as this table, right? Half of that is occupied by dried apple slices. <laughs> Do you realize <laughs> how many jars, 20 jars of dried apple slices is? It's, it's a, a good huge, way to preserve it's, them. It's like all of it's like slightly you can bigger only than this, so many but there's twenty apples. of them. Anyways, thanks Edward for uh, dropping in tonight, and uh, we'll see uh, Angelica on Sunday, and and uh, Tina, Tina. Gregor Pierce uh, as well. Hello again, and we'll see you as well. <laughs> so, anyways, catch you guys later. Live life out. Cheers and cheeks out. Anthony out. Anthony out. <laughs> We are crazy for <laughs> ending.